Hello again, Ian Stokey with Mastermind Games. This time painting one of the uh, Blind Purchase Space Marine heroes, so... I'm using these guys to test out alternate color schemes. And since it's pretty close to April Fool's Day, we'll start with something silly. So, I've already painted over, since I'm doing a lighter color scheme, I've already painted over the armor with pure white 09039. Now I'm taking Marigold Yellow 09007. Now, <laughs> the concept here <laughs> was inspired by a weird video I came across on YouTube a while back, where a secondary character in a video game was randomly replaced with Fred Flintstone. So... Here's the Brotherhood of Flint and Stone. Now, I will do some more serious color schemes. Imperial Fists, Salamanders, White Scars, I have uh, some of these guys earmarked for that already. But, like I said, April Fool's is just around the corner. Probably will already have hit by the time I... Uh, finish up, but, eh. so yeah, and that's not the only custom and or parody chapter I've conceived of, stuffed up from that cold, so I'm having a little trouble breathing. Like, bad enough to wake me up every two hours. Being completely incapable of, uh, breathing. Alright, and that's a start. that dry for a bit, then I can get the next base coat. Okay. 09017 True Blue. Still getting over a uh, bad cold, otherwise, this would have been uploaded on April Fool's Day. Still might be, but if it is, it's going to be uh, later in the afternoon or evening. But can't control when you get sick for the most part. Okay, I might do a little more of this, but for now, <clears throat> Stormy Gray 09088.
I have no idea at this time how many of these uh, Space Marine Heroes models I'm going to buy for doing these alternate color schemes. So, <clears throat> if you have any uh, that you want to see, just let me know. I can use that as a guideline. I'm already going to do Imperial Fists, Salamanders, and White Scars, and then a one other uh, original chapter, but It's not a grenade. You know, there's been a lot of concern that Games Workshop might ditch most of the Space Marines line in favor of Primaris models. But <laughs> Oiled Leather 09110. I think, personally, that'd be about the stupidest move they could possibly make. I think they realize that because if they ditch the entire range of space marines except for the Primaris models, I'll just take everybody and their dog off. If you recall a game called Mage Knight, which was one of the first blind purchase uh, collectible miniatures games that came out in the early 90s, something that slaughtered that was they uh, retired or rather, banned from organized play, all sets prior to uh, what was their most current release. So, that sales plummeted after that, and the game just crashed. And if you're familiar with the game Hero Clicks, Mage Knight came before and was in many ways it was made by the same company and in many ways was its prototype. So <clears throat> yeah. surest, surest way to uh, kill your own business is to tick off your customers. Okay. And there's one more empty magazine on the ground here. Trying to keep an eye out for spent bolter casings, but I don't see any. Okay. So. <coughs> Cloudy Gray 09089. So I won't be doing any uh, basing on this since it has a scenic base. feet for that spent magazine I just finished painting. Still a little runny, but that's I can work with that. I'll be fine. You want to simulate this kind of texture for any model. I've seen other people use uh, pieces of cork board for it. For that. I just don't do it myself personally. <laughs> 09143 Yellow Bone. Just 
0902 deep red. We'll just plug it up. So, paper clip. Zero nine one nine seven old bronze. that dry and then I can start on the <clears throat> shading. Okay. Sapphire Blue 09016. Shade about half paint, half water in most cases. Aged Pewter 09196. And Ruddy Leather 09109. Stained Ivory 09142. If I'm careful, I can get the entirety of the purity seal in one go.
even deep red zero nine or no blood red brick zero nine zero zero one. Zero nine zero zero six fire orange. I do have some backstory to the Brothers of Flint and Stone here. And that is simply that they came across an ancient recording of the Flint Stones, recognizing it as a pre Imperium sacred relic, which has since been confiscated by the Inquisition. Now I've uh, decided to attempt to recreate humanity's lost technology by starting from scratch. Being closely watched by both the Inquisition because of their ingenuity and the Adeptus Mechanicus for in case they actually manage to rediscover something lost. But <laughs> Chapter Space Marines showing an almost orc like uh, improvisation. Something very rare in the Imperium. And trying tactics no one else would be stupid enough to try again outside of an orc. And chapter having been known to carry their vehicles into combat when they take too much damage or otherwise break down. One day I might uh, modify a uh, rhino to have a bunch of little legs sticking out underneath, but that's not something I'm going to do for a good long while. Might not be uh, quite orange enough, but gonna roll with it anyway. Okay. Gonna have to let that dry before I get to the next step. But getting there. Okay, second to last shade. Pure black zero nine zero three seven. So I maybe should have gone a bit uh, darker on the orange, but can't change now. Still, the purpose of these Space Marine Hero videos is to experiment. So and need extra water when you're thinning out black into a wash. Otherwise, it gets too dark and it'll completely obscure the details you're trying to bring out. So. I was hoping to get this video ready to release on April Fool's Day, April 1st, but it just didn't work out, so... <coughs> it, it happens. To be fair, I didn't expect to get a uh, cold that would almost floor me either, but... I uh, can't 
can only predict when you're going to get sick. Drop my brush, I wound up dropping it in the weirdest way possible. And I hear my neighbors starting to yell again. Good grief. We don't think they do this on purpose every time I try to record, but I have one of them yet. You know, I make these videos, I work on these all the time, so. Giving them fair, more than enough fair warning on that. Okay. Let that dry, then do the last base coat, or last shade, excuse me. Okay. Stormy Gray 09088, last shade here. Pure white 09039, get that in the eyes. Just prep that for some whiting. Zero nine zero three seven. We'll go ahead and get the gun barrel. And this is a calculated risk, but I'll try to do the lighting effect. So pale green zero nine zero one two. So this is, a, again, a calculated risk since I just put the white on there, but we'll see if it works or not. I'm going with a cool color, with the warm color being yellow, orange, and red, and the cool being violet, green, and blue, to contrast with the armor's orange. Okay, and that's not bad at all. So, once that's all dried up, I can highlight detail and wrap this up. Okay. Time to highlight. Cloudy Gray 09089. frustrated I wasn't able to get this ready in time for April Fool's Day and I'm not going to be too hard about on myself about it because again I can't control when I'm sick Today, I don't sound like I've been uh, gargling asphalt. <clears throat> and then 
sun yellow zero nine zero zero eight. So yeah, this definitely turned out more yellow than orange, so I'll have to just remember that for next time I do something along these lines. Burned orange zero nine one one one. Sky blue zero nine zero one eight. Creamy Ivory zero nine one four four. Blood Red zero nine zero zero three. Tarnished Brass zero nine one nine eight. Misty Gray, zero nine zero nine zero.
Okay. Now for a few details. 09037, pure black. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, still getting over those bugs. Spent magazines, the empty chamber there, and Sacred words. Yaba. Daba. And do. And uh, I'm going to do this. Flathead to polish up the edge of the base. <laughs> and there we go. Belated April Fool's Day, Brothers of Flint and Stone. Next time I touch one of these Space Marine heroes, it'll be something a little more iconic and serious. I don't know exactly when, but until then, I, until next time, I am Ian Stuckey with Mastermind Games, signing out.